happy ending. Come on, y'all. You too. Yeah, yeah, buddy. I'm headed to work. Uh -huh. Turn that off before I get a copyright strike. They've been tearing my ass up with the copyright strikes, y'all. And that is all right. Strike me down with the copyright. Because I, I got to give the people, uh, give the people what they want. Hey, huh, uh, what's your bad say? All right, y'all ready? Here we go. Right with me. <laughs> Sunday, the day before Memorial Day, and of course, I work at the Lion Food Line, that is, and these groceries don't stop. Groceries don't stop. Y'all want barbecue sauce, y'all want uh, steaks and, and chicken and green peppers and onions. Y'all want all that on your doggone dinner table for Memorial Day? Well, I got to go get them. I got to go get them, y'all. And I ain't got no problem doing it. Let go thumper, y'all. Everybody say hi to thumping. <laughs> I am the man for the job, and I am I on I Kill Your Highway. Get ready to get on this Pellissippi. Oh, I got behind somebody's pawpaw. We ain't gonna, we ain't gonna bag on uh, getting too damn rared up. It's Sunday. Ain't nobody doing nothing out here but me. So. Everybody else is enjoying their Memorial Day. And I'm going to enjoy it too by making some money. And I am Dark Side. This will be the first part of the second week that I have been running the Dark Side again. My new Dark Side. I've been running the Dark Side for about five, six years now. But this is my second tire. And I am in full tilt on my traction suspension i got some new fork seals in now by my man corbin over there at power sports and they feel good they look good my confidence level is up around them clouds on my trip you know you gotta you gotta take your maintenance you got to do your maintenance on these on these machines, you know. Especially if you run around the country the way old Slappy Dog with Slappy Adventures do. And my friends, you can best believe that I be on my buddy's hind end about the maintenance and, you know, you, you can't predict a breakdown. You can't predict one. And, you, and, and if you could... Now I'm going to you make a lot of money because you're going to be like, hey, I wouldn't go because your damn transmission going to go out. But you, all you can do is uh, take the best preventative services that you can and uh, try to get in front of it. If, if a, a breakdown shows its ugly face, I'd rather show it right here in town where I can adjust. But that is basically what I got the F6B for. The F6B 
I got it to um, be a backup bike if I got a road trip planned and uh, something goes wrong with my Gold Getter, my Gold Wing, my 2012. So I've got the F6B set up with the wine harness to pull the trailer. I got the uh, uh, trailer hitch to pull my trailer. So if I need to, I can hook up to that F6B and pull it, pull my Hannigan trailer with uh, my F6B at any given time. But the primary for that F6B is I was in the market to buy another car. You know, I, I work about 45 miles away. All my vehicles are V8s. My, uh, my two trucks and my 064. All of everything I got is a V8. So it gets a little pricey, you know, running 100 miles a day to work, back and forth to work. So my my thought was to get a, you know, a little small cylinder car. And, uh, of course, I end up with a daggum F6B. I needed another motorcycle like I needed another hole in my head. But this is what we got. I like it. During the summer months, I, I ride the bike just about as every day unless there's some kind of rain that's setting in before I leave to go to work I ride the motorcycle man shoot if, if, if I know it's gonna rain and I've already gone then that you know I just deal with it but if it's some raining before I leave the house it's hard for me to leave the house in the rain you know I on a motorcycle that is it's hard for me to leave my house and it's, and it's piss pouring raining you know I just jump in the truck go on to work on a road trip, you know, your time is your time is. So if it's, if it's gonna rain on a Tuesday, and it's raining on Tuesday, and it ain't supposed to stop until Thursday, what do you do? Oh, slap your dog gonna leave in the rain. You know, I just, you know, I, my time is my time. I don't have, I'm still working stiff, so I don't have uh, the luxury of pushing stuff back. And then, you know, especially when you got people that you're meeting, you're somewhat on a time schedule, but if I could leave a day before the rain hit, so be it. But if not, then I just have to leave in the rain. I might not be able to move as fast and as swiftly as I would on a good, perfect A, B day like today. But we still gonna get on out there and start enjoying them good uh, adventures. But as I said, when I hit these interstates, it ain't much to see here. I got plenty to talk about, so I'm going to get back with you when I get on Edgemore Road. And Edgemore Road is that -a way. Hey, thanks for watching another episode of Slappy Adventures. Please like, share, and comment. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button. <laughs> hey, stay tuned for more videos like these. Thanks for watching.